How do you keep your vibration high even when you're in the environment of negative vibrations? This could be in the form of your thoughts or it could be your environment. The first thing is having awareness, noticing that there was a frequency shift. Once you notice there's a frequency shift, we can allow observation to give us information. Was the frequency shift something within myself, meaning my thoughts, or is there something in my environment that my body is picking up on that is at a lower frequency? A lot of times when we are growing up, we learn to scope our environment for the lowest frequency. This is actually a method that is based in the primal body. When we know what the lowest frequency of our environment is, then we are safe. Well, the same thing can happen with our thoughts. Without even knowing it, we go into our thought patterns and find the lowest vibrational thought because if we know what the lowest vibrational thought is, then we feel that we can be safe. Now that we know this, we can use awareness to actually shift to focusing on the highest frequency. This doesn't necessarily mean that you have to go find the highest frequency person in the room, but you can have fun with it. You can use your body and your awareness to scope out what is the highest frequency in the room. You're not doing this in order to match the frequency. You're just doing it for information. And then you can do the same thing with your thoughts. What is the highest frequency thought that is in the same scope of the thought that was in a negative? When we do this, we start to see the world as frequency. And what is frequency? It's information but that information has an intelligence. So once we have the information of choosing, yes, this is an experience that I would like to have. This is a vibration that I would like to step into and experience. Then we can step into that and start to attune our consciousness to the intelligence that it holds. Then we start to open up to new thought and have a new experience, no matter what's going on around us. So have a lot of fun with it. And until we meet again, I'm sending you all so much love and a big hug.